the Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features You'll find the beauty goes much deeper Once you get to meet her You see her walking down the boulevard Good morning Beaches, welcome and welcome back to the channel. Now today, me and the girls didn't really have anything planned because we had kind of a weird incident last night. The girls come back from their friend's house but the mum of the friend is kind of crazy, a bit of a Karen, don't tell her that I told you. And the girls just come home last night feeling really sick. So I don't know if they maybe ate something bad or I'm not quite too sure. But they still haven't woke up yet. And let me check the time on my watch. It's 12 p.m. So it's really late in the day. Even I'm late to be getting ready. So I'm just going to quickly get changed and stuff in my room. But yeah, I'm not too sure how the girls are feeling now. They still haven't woke up. So it can't be a good sign. All right, now let's just grab this outfit. This looks cool. I don't assume we're going out anywhere today, so I'm just gonna put on this nice casual outfit. Perfect, there we go. I've just slicked my hair up into this really messy bun, but the braid looks kind of cute. So yeah, nothing too crazy. I've just got on a nice pink tank and some joggers, but you know, I'm not gonna bother getting all dressed up if I'm not going out anywhere today. Uh, you know what? I'll let the girls lay in for a little bit longer. Maybe they are just having a lay in, you know, it could be nothing. So I'm just gonna make them some breakfast and I feel like maybe some bacon and eggs would be nice. I really do hope they're feeling okay because like I said, I'm not quite sure what's brought this on. Maybe they had a bad time or they just got bored of the Karen mum moaning. She is usually quite rude, but you know, I would never admit that to her. But anyway, I don't want to be gossiping about mums. You know what it's like, mum drama these days. But yeah, maybe they just ate something bad. I'm not quite too sure. Or I could just be completely overreacting. They might be fine. But like I said, I'm just going to make them some breakfast. I'm actually really excited for some bacon and eggs. And hopefully they've got their appetite. I'm just going to leave it on this dining table over here and put them out a portion each and then for drinks i'll probably just grab them some water if they you know aren't feeling good i mean it has been really hot lately as well because we are still in the summer break so you know we're very lucky with the good weather and stuff so it could be some dehydration going on so let's just grab them a water each and i'll grab them for myself too because it's really important to stay hydrated in this heat and after that i'm just going to go upstairs and check on them because i'm not quite sure what's up all right, perfect, all done. Now let's go up. I'm gonna check up on Taylor first because Taylor is a lot easier to wake up, which is kind of shocking seeing as she's the teenager of the family, but she likes to be very productive. Taylor, are you okay? Oh. Hi, mom. That doesn't sound too good. Here, let me open your curtains. Oh, my eyes. It's not too bright outside. Are you feeling okay? No. What is that up your nose? A tissue? Obviously. Come on, out of bed. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh. Uh, oh, you do not look too good. Oh, thanks. What? I didn't mean it like that. I'm just saying you don't look yourself. It's breakfast downstairs. It is. Are you still got an appetite? Hmm, not really. Okay, well, there's some water for you downstairs. If you want, I could maybe whip up something else. Mm, coffee? That no. Would help. No, coffee. Ha ha, very funny. Oh. All right, go on, go downstairs and I'll come in a minute. Evie, come on now, it's time to wake up. Oh, you're still in bed? <coughs> oh gosh, not the coughing. Here, let me open up your curtains, get some sunlight in here, and turn the light on. Come on, Evie. I don't want to get up. You have to. Come on. Achoo! Taylor's waiting downstairs. She didn't feel too much herself either, but, you know, she's up and ready. Come on. Oh, fine. Achoo! Come on, let's get up because we don't want to, you know, make ourselves feel worse by just staying in bed. It's not the best thing, even though it may feel like it right now. Let's turn these lights off. And come on, let's go downstairs. I mean, seeing as you guys are both feeling not yourselves, I guess I'll just stay in this comfy kind of loungewear today because I guess it's going to be a nice day looking after you guys. Let's hope I don't get sick either. 
well, girls, I I made us some breakfast. Do you want to, you know, at least try and eat? I mean, I know you kind of lost your appetite, but you know, I still really think you should try and eat something because you don't want to go hungry. Fine, but I'm really not feeling it. Don't listen. If you don't want to eat, then you don't have to force it. But at least drink some water. Uh, well, when did you guys start feeling sick? Was it like, was you just having fun and you just suddenly it was felt all sick? Just yesterday, I bet she's poisoned us. Tell her she would not poison you. I mean, I know she's a bit of a cavern, but you know that is exactly. insane. Uh, Taylor, come on, let's not be crazy now. You know how weird she is, though. Uh, where is Evie gone? Oh my gosh, she's probably tried to sneak off back into bed. Well, listen, I know she is a bit mad, but to say that she's poisoned you, come on now, hit yourself. It makes total sense. She hates us as well. All right, Taylor. Well, she can't hate you that much, otherwise she wouldn't have invited you to her house, would she? Mm, I guess. Now here, just leave the dirty dishes in the sink. We'll do it later, because you don't want to be doing dishes when you're feeling unwell. Okay. All right, cool. Now, we'll just wait till Evie comes back down. She might have gone to the bathroom or something. And then maybe we could get you guys some medicine. Oh, I hate medicine. Uh, it's your favourite, I think. You guys always say you like. Yeah. It's cat <gasps> uh, but well, I, re- I really need some medicine. Oh, all of a sudden, huh? Seriously, I what do. is with kids and liking cowpole? Honestly, I mean, it, it is kind of good, but you know, it's medicine. We only have you it when we're proved, sick. You just disproved your point. Well, it's just, I think it's just a kid thing. I don't think I would want to have it now, but you know. Uh, I don't like this sick taste in my mouth. It's disgusting. <laughs> <coughs> I'm packed, mum. <coughs> There you go, there you are. Um, well, I mean, Taylor wasn't feeling much of an appetite, but could you at least drink some water for me, like I said to Taylor, because you need to make sure you're staying hydrated because it's kind of hot out here still. Okay. Okay, cool. Now, I think you're gonna be happy about this, weirdly enough, like Taylor too, but uh, I need you guys to have some medicine. It's cowpole. Yeah! I mean, <laughs> my throat hurts. Okay, well, come on, up we get. Um, I will never understand the whole cowpole thing, but come on, here we go. I think I've got it in the pantry with a... Yeah, me first. here we go. Oh, me first. Me first? You guys are Best crazy. Best till last. Well, we've got some cowpole and a first aid kit. Yeah, okay. I'll even pour myself some. Taylor, that is way too much. Put it down. I need to measure no, the not. correct. Yes, it is. No, right. That's enough. That's enough. Look, I only had a little bit. Right. Okay, but girls, seriously, you cannot be having ridiculous amounts of cowpole. Okay, it's a medicine. Now, come on, Evie, you have that bit. Okay. Good. That's what I like to hear. Now, come on. I'll just take this one and put it in the bin. Seriously, guys, you cannot be drinking ridiculous amounts of cowpole. Okay. To my room, I'm tired. Okay, you guys can go back up to your room. I'm gonna take out the trash because it was getting way overfilled. All right, girls. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go take the trash out. I feel really bad because I don't know what the main cause of it was. So I can't really help them too much until, you know, we find out a bit more. Maybe I should ring their friend's mum and see when they started to feel sick. I've got a feeling they may be eating something that they don't like so much. Oh, hi, Miss, uh, what's your name again? Oh, Miss Karen, right. Uh, I just wanted to ring you because I'm pretty sure you know that the girls felt sick. Yeah, that's right. When about did they start to feel sick? After dinner, what did they eat? Salmon? Not the salmon. Uh, yeah, you know, they've never really handled salmon well. Excuse me, don't get rude to me, lady. How was I supposed to expect you to make salmon? Oh, I'm ending the phone on this woman. Who makes salmon for eight and 12 year olds? It's just ridiculous, oh my goodness. Oh, not me expecting her to make nuggets or something. I mean, they must be some high class family because I would not be giving the kids salmon at their age. All right, come on kids, I've told you out of your, oh, okay, you're not in bed. Are you okay, Evie? Yeah, I'm just reading. Hopefully it'll make me feel better. Good idea. Uh, maybe you should come downstairs. It's kind of hot up here in your room and, you know, it's really good to get some fresh air when you're feeling unwell. Okay. Come on then, let's go downstairs and let's try convince Taylor too. Yes, I'm winning the game. Uh, 
Much for feeling sick. Taylor, come on, you know I you should... I am ill. Do not hit my nose. Yes, I know you feel ill, but come on, you can't be going on your PC. That's not the correct thing to be doing when you're feeling under the weather. Now, come on. All right, girls. Well, I think, look, you should come outside and just sit on the lounges, okay? No going on the trampoline and stuff, because that's only going to make you feel worse, but you really need to get some fresh air. Okay. Fine. Now, is there anything I can get for you guys to make you feel better? Nope. Well, maybe some coffee. Uh, no. Oh yeah, coffee would do. Uh, yeah, I think not. How about a tea? Fine. Uh, can I have a hot cocoa instead? Uh, I don't know. It's it's a bit too sugary for feeling unwell. I don't want you to be sick. Um, I'll be fine. Are you sure, Evie? Because you know yourself if you will be or not. Of course, I'll be fine. Okay. All right. right I'll go make it. I'll totally not be fine. Mum is so stupid for believing you. Hi. Well, I really hope Evie will be okay. I mean, she said that she'll be fine with a hot cocoa and, you know, she knows in her gut. So if she can't handle it, then, you know, she only has herself to blame. But let's just hope the hot cocoa is fine. I haven't added as much sugar, so hopefully that should make a difference. And let's get a tea with no sugars for Taylor. Okay, and looks like the hot cocoa is done. So let's hope they are satisfied with this. But yeah, I'm just hoping they start to feel a little bit better. Here goes. Thanks, mum. You're welcome. Here's your hot cocoa. Please don't be sick. And here's yours, Taylor. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, I really think that when you're feeling under the weather, you should have maybe a cold shower or a warm bath. What do you guys want? I want a cold shower. Okay, and Evie? A hot bath. Okay, well, Evie, I'll set the bathroom upstairs for you, and Taylor, I'll obviously set the downstairs one for you for the shower, okay? Now, you guys just get some fresh air, okay? Don't be doing anything too mad, and I will be back soon, okay? Okay. Perfect. Now, here, let me go into the downstairs bathroom. I'll just close the curtains ready for whenever Taylor's ready. And, okay, let's just grab some shampoo, conditioner, if she wants to, to wash her hair, and some body lotion. Okay, well, I think that's it. And I'll go set up the upstairs bathroom for Evie. Hopefully, this will make them feel a lot better. For me, personally, I do like to have either a cold shower or a warm bath when I'm feeling under the weather. Okay, now let's grab some appliances. <music> Now, let me have a look. Oh, it looks like the bath is a little dirty, so I'm just going to clean it up really quickly before Evie uses it. That should do the trick. Oh, perfect. That looks 10 times better. All right, well, I'm going to go grab them then, and hopefully, you know, they're feeling a little bit better. Okay, right, let's go out to the girls, see how they're doing. Girls! Girls? Uh <gasps> oh, hey, Mum. Hey, Mum. Hey, Mum, very casual. Guys, what are you doing? You know you can't be going on the trampoline. You're going to feel more sick jumping up and down. We just wanted to have some fun. I know, but unfortunately, being sick isn't very fun, okay? Taylor, the swings isn't going to help either. Come on, off you get. Oh, why? Evie, you don't need to jump into the pool. You've got a bath upstairs. Come out. Oh, fine. We just want to have some Thank fun. Thank you. Well, when you're feeling under the weather, you know, you have to maybe wait a day or two for fun. Okay. Oh, it looks like Taylor's got everything that she needs. And come on, Evie, let's make sure you've got everything. Okay, so do you want any of your bath toys, like a rubber duck or something? Sure. Okay, we'll chuck that in there. Look, you've got your body lotion and stuff down here. You've got a towel here as well. And if you need to brush your teeth again, because I know what it's like to have that sicky taste in your mouth, the toothpaste is up here and your electric toothbrush. So that's everything, okay? Yep. Perfect. All right, then we'll just call me if you need anything. Okay, Mum. <laughs> I'm feeling so sick. I think I'm going to go relax and watch some TV. Okay, well, Taylor grabbed herself some pyjamas, but I'm just going to grab some for Evie. Okay, right, I'm just going to put these outside of the bathroom door pair. Evie, honey, I've left you some new pyjamas outside of your bathroom door, okay? Okay, thanks, Mum. Is everything okay in there? Are you feeling a bit better? Yep. Perfect. Actually, no. <laughs> oh, okay, well, sorry you're feeling unwell, but we'll be waiting for you downstairs, okay? 
Okay. Oh, good choice, Taylor. Cooking show. Nice and relaxing, even though Gordon Bloxy does like to shout. Yeah, well, there wasn't much else on anyway. Yeah. I'm going to watch with you. Here you go. Lots of room on the sofa. Uh, chew. <coughs> oh, gosh, this is such a nightmare. Good evening, Peaches. It's currently later in the evening and the girls have just kind of been watching TV all day. They're still watching cooking programs on Netflix. Um, But, you know, honestly, I just don't mind what they do today. Just whatever they feel best with. But I think it's definitely time they have another bit of medicine because it's been so many hours now. They haven't had medicine since the morning. And then I'm just going to ask them what they fancy for dinner because, I mean, it's kind of late and they still haven't really felt any better. So, you know, whatever they're fancying, even if it's just something really plain, then I'm happy to do so. Here, girls, it's time for your second bit of medicine. Oh, cowpole. Yeah. Of course. You're Thank welcome. You, um... <coughs> oh, gosh, that cough has not got any better. <coughs> Well, guys, I know you're not really feeling yourself still. What did you want for dinner? Mmm, I don't know. A bit of cereal would do. Uh, what, just dry cereal? Yeah, yeah. keep it dry. Okay, uh, well, I mean, it's probably one of the best things to have because, you know, you don't want to be eating anything too crazy while you're feeling under the weather. But you can't have Lucky Charms, girls. It's too sugary. No! Then what else can we have? There's no other nice cereal. Uh, dry Weetabix? Ew. No. Okay, fine then. How about dry toast? Oh. I guess that will do for me. Oh. Okay. Evie, bit of dry toast? Only because Taylor's having it. All right, well, I'll go get that ready. Oh, I feel so bad for the girls. I don't really want to eat my dinner in front of them because... It's probably not the best when you're feeling under the weather, but I'm just going to make them some toast because there isn't really much they can have, unfortunately. But yeah, I think after this, I should probably take them up to bed because I don't want them to be having a really late night. And yeah, then I guess that's everything. Come on, girls, come sit at the table for your toast. Can't we have it on the couch? No, not on the couch. I know you're feeling unwell, but you've been on the couch all day. Fine. You know, you must make sure that you're still staying active and stuff because staying in the same spot, you're going to get cramps. All right, girls, here we go. Some nice toast. Sorry, it's just dry, but, you know, it's better than nothing. Well, girls, how are we feeling? Any better? Not really. No, maybe a good night's sleep will help it. Yeah, I think after this toast, I'll tuck you girls into bed and you can have an early night. I think I'm gonna... Uh, What, Evie? I need to run to the bathroom now. Oh, no, I know. I shouldn't have had that hot chocolate. Why is Mum always right? Mum! Ew, there's chunks in it. Lol. Oh no, it looks like I'm going to be spending my evening cleaning this mess up. Well, Peaches, I really hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, then be sure to like and subscribe to join the Pretty Peach family. And once you subscribe, be sure to hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a video. Be sure to comment down below your favourite part of this video. We'd love to hear all of your favourite bits. If you haven't already, then be sure to join my Discord server because that's where I'm most active with you guys. And follow me on Roblox to join my games. Be sure to follow my group on Roblox as well because if you join, I'll be releasing and some stuff on there soon be sure to check down below for all of my other social medias and also be sure to check out my real life merch and my recording equipment and if you do make any purchases then be sure to tag me on social media i'd love to see what you ordered thank you guys so much for watching love you all so much and i'll see you guys next time bye peaches <coughs> <coughs> <A cheat. coughs>